Hi, and welcome to our pilot episode of the Africa Law Tech Show. In this show, hosted by the Lawyers Hub, we'll be discussing all things law and technology, and we are glad that you could join us for this first episode. There's a lot of talk about AI and how it will change our lives and the way business is done. By now, you've no doubt been bombarded with tweets and articles about ChatGPT, the latest artificial intelligence technology that has been the source of a lot of excitement and fear in roughly equal measure. Although there are many definitions for artificial intelligence and machine learning, at their heart they all seek to have computers recognize meaningful and valuable patterns in databases with as little intervention as possible. Of all the subsets of artificial intelligence, generative AI has been the one which has been making a lot of noise lately, and so we'll focus on that in this video. Basically, generative AI refers to any type of AI that can produce unique images, videos, audios, and text from human prompts. ChatGPT is the most famous example of a generative AI. ChatGPT is an artificial intelligence chatbot that was developed and released by a company called OpenAI in November 2022. One of the key features of ChatGPT is its ability to understand the context of a conversation and generate appropriate responses which mimic human writing. Basically, you just need to prompt the chatbot about any topic and you'll receive a human-like response. Explain artificial intelligence in simple terms. Artificial intelligence, AI, is a simulation of human intelligence processes by computer systems. These processes include learning, the acquisition of information and rules for using the information, reasoning, using the rules to reach approximate or definite conclusions, and self-correction. Explain artificial intelligence to a 10-year-old. Artificial intelligence is like a computer brain that can think and learn on its own. It can understand things and make decisions like a human can, but it doesn't get tired or make mistakes. It's used in things like self-driving cars, video games, and even some toys. Think of it as a really smart robot helper that can do things for us. Outside of basic conversations, millions of people worldwide have been showcasing how ChatGPT is doing their jobs or tasks for them, using it to generate and debug code, writing articles and essays, and even job applications. It's impressive how far artificial intelligence has evolved, and ChatGPT is the best example of what AI can do and what's to come. Now that we know what artificial intelligence is and have an idea of how ChatGPT works, I'm sure you're curious to find out how ChatGPT will disrupt the way lawyers and law firms operate. But before we do that, kindly take a look at this ad for one of our projects here at The Lawyers. Privacy professionals are becoming crucial for the running of any organization. And this is why it's important for lawyers to develop their data privacy knowledge or practice in the area of privacy law. For the first time ever, the Lawyers Hub will be offering a monthly four-day training on data protection that is certified by the International Association of Privacy Professionals, IAPP the world's largest, most comprehensive global information privacy organization. Upon successful completion of this training, you will be awarded with a certification from the Africa Digital Policy Institute and the Lawyers Hub and be eligible to seat the IAPP exams for certification as a privacy professional. Register for this training and become certified as a specialist in privacy law. For more information about this training, visit lawyershub.org slash training or email hello at lawyershub.ke. AI is a revolutionary technology that will open up a world of new possibilities and ChatGBT is just the start. AI will disrupt the way that we work and the legal profession is no exception. We asked our colleagues at the Lawyers Hub how ChatGPT can help lawyers in their work, and this is what they had to say. Lawyers can use ChatGPT for legal research by utilizing its natural language processing capabilities to quickly and efficiently search through large amounts of legal information. Lawyers can do this by inputting specific legal questions or keywords 
related to their research topics, and then using the model's generated text to find relevant case law, statutes, or other legal resources. ChatGPT can be helpful to lawyers for generating legal documents, for example, contracts, demand letters, briefs, and memos, and this can save lawyers time and effort in document creation. This can be done by providing the model with a set of prompts and templates outlining the structure and content of the desired document, along with any relevant legal language or information. The model can then use this information to generate a draft of the document, which the lawyer can then use to review and edit as needed. This process can save lawyers time and effort in creating legal documents and can also help them to ensure consistency and accuracy in the language used. ChatGPT can also help lawyers with summarization by quickly identifying key information and relevant passages within large legal documents. This can be done by training the model on a specific legal corpus, such as case law or statutes, and then inputting a document or set of documents for the model to summarize. The model can then generate a summary of the most important points or relevant sections of the document, which can save lawyers a significant amount of time and effort when conducting research or reviewing large amounts of information. Additionally, ChatGPT can be fine-tuned on specific legal domains such as contracts, patents, trademarks, and many more to provide more accurate and relevant summaries of legal documents. Lawyers and law firms can also use ChatGPT to assist with marketing. Lawyers can use ChatGPT to generate content for their website, social media, and other marketing materials. This can also include blog posts, articles, and other written content that can provide valuable information to potential clients and help establish the lawyer as an expert in their field. ChatGPT can also be used to generate compelling headlines, email subject lines, and other marketing copy that can help to increase engagement and drive traffic to the lawyer's website. Additionally, ChatGPT can be used to generate client testimonials, case summaries, and other marketing materials that can help to build trust and credibility with potential clients. The above examples are some practical ways in which ChatGPT can be a valuable tool for lawyers. No doubt, ChatGPT is a game changer, and we cannot wait for what AI has to offer in 2023 and the years to come. As we come to the end of this video, we would like to know if you've used ChatGPT and what you've used it for. Also, what do you think about AI in general and AI tools like ChatGPT? Do you think that jobs in the legal industry are at risk because of AI? Please feel free to let us know in the comment section and do not forget to subscribe to this channel so that you do not miss out on any new episodes of the show. Also, check out the Africa Law Tech podcast on Spotify for the audio version of this show. See you on the next episode.